Okay, so one of the techniques we've been working on this week is a leg drag pass. A uh, leg drag pass is one of the most dynamic passes in Jiu Jitsu, so we want to take advantage of every entry we can to get in there and use those pass. Okay, so like oftentimes if I'm starting on the outside with Aaron here, the first thing that I want to do is I just want to get in close and start isolating a leg. So right hand's going to pummel outside, left hand's going to pop the leg up. I want to crowd the hips. Now watch, right hand comes around. I'm going to push those toes back and I'm going to enter my leg drag. Now from here, I want to start moving to the right. I'm going to block that outside leg. Right knee's going to go to the mat and I need to keep good base here to keep good uh, positioning. Now from here, I'm going to feed my right hand to the collar. I'm going to pull that coll collar grip in as my right elbow goes over his thigh. Now, typically when I'm doing this pass, my head's low. For sake of talking to the camera, I gotta look up at you. But when you guys do this pass, make sure you bring your head down and you grab the belt. Now from here, I'm gonna start to circle. As I circle, I wanna start cinching my forearms together. So I'm bringing my forearms together like this, okay? When they connect together, it creates opposing forces and creates more pressure on air. So from that cinch, I'm up on my toes but I'm gonna turn back in towards Aaron to get my underhooks. And now I can start pinning him in side control. So again, from the start, I want you guys to think, we're gonna come in, we're gonna want a nice low stance to begin. Right hand's pummeling outside, his left hand comes up. We're crowding the hips, with the hips. Now from here, we redirect that foot, bringing it down, and now we can start entering our leg drag position. Again, from here, right hand's gonna pull that collar in. I bring my head low, and I start to circle. Looking to pick. 